this video we are going to be making some pumpkin pie french toast in the air fryer i'm really excited about this we've got two eggs we'll probably use about a fourth a cup of this pumpkin puree and then the real special part of this is the cinnamon bread i have been raving about this and i absolutely love the cinnamon bread but then they also have some pumpkin pie bread at the store as well if you'd rather use that but i just thought the cinnamon bread would be good since i know i already love it and we'll just put some pumpkin pie spice in the mix as well as this pumpkin of course and then i might add a little bit of ground cinnamon too we'll see and then while this is cooking we're going to make up some whipped pumpkin pie honey butter to put on top of it so make sure you watch to see that as well okay we're going to use our two eggs get those cracked up right into the pan that I'm gonna be dipping the bread into. The one fourth a cup of pumpkin. One teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice. Also gonna do a dash of salt, just a little sprinkle. And a little bit of extra cinnamon, just because I love cinnamon. Whisk this all up and then we'll dip our bread into it and get the air fryer started. I'm gonna put the air fryer on 350 and then we'll probably cook it for about four minutes on each side. We'll just play it by ear and see how it goes. Now to dip the bread, I'm just gonna get it nice and coated on both sides. This should do about four to six pieces of bread. Mm, that already looks good. If you have one of those inserts that you could spray and put the French toast in, then that would probably work great, but this without the insert works fine too. Okay, now on to the whipped pumpkin pie honey butter. That is a mouthful. I've got two sticks of butter that I've had sitting out to get to room temperature. And I'm gonna beat these up with my hand mixer first until they're nice and smooth and fluffy. Then we've got half a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, a teaspoon of vanilla, six tablespoons of that pumpkin puree that we already opened, and then one fourth a cup of honey. Or you could use maple syrup instead. So we're gonna mix this up and then we'll add in some of our other ingredients, starting with the pumpkin pie spice mix, adding in one ingredient at a time and mixing it up very well before adding the next. to add in the half a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice mix. Then mix that around. I thought I was filming and wasn't, but I did go ahead and add in the six tablespoons of the pumpkin puree and mix that all around. Now I'm gonna add in a teaspoon of vanilla and one fourth a cup of honey. Doesn't that just look amazing? I will leave the recipe in the description box for you guys, as usual. So here you have it. We've got our air fried pumpkin pie French toast. I drizzled some syrup on it. And then this was me being a little extra, but I put the whipped butter into a popping bag just to try to make it look a little extra pretty, but you can just do whatever you want, plop it on there however you can. It is still gonna be amazing. 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you try this out, I would love to hear about it over here or on Instagram. But until next time, I'll see you later. Bye, y'all.